I called Orange Cab last night. Oh, yeah? And they and y'all were busy. Y'all were busy because it's Friday night. Yeah. So he told me to call Blue Cab. Yeah. So I called Blue Cab, and I was, you know, I was, I was dicking around, taking time, getting ready. That guy was like, like, he was there in like, t like I, I would say less than ten minutes. I mean, he was just like, boom, right there. Yeah, well, sometimes you, if you got lucky, you find the cab like, like me. Well, mm -hmm. me, when you call me, I all the time came from downtown. Right. I drove like 10 miles to get to you, but I was, it didn't took me too long. If he, you want to make money, you give somebody time, you need to be out there. He must have been, he must have been like at Greyhound or somewhere yeah, close. Yeah. Sometimes they got people uh, sitting at Greyhound, yeah. And that's where I came from. I came from Greyhound. And they changed the station. It's not mm -hmm. all East Town. It's all rich now. How 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 far is from Greyhound to here? How far is that? Like uh, it's like ten miles. Ten miles. Yeah. You came out. You came ten miles out here to pick yeah. me up. Yeah. Oh, okay. It cost me money, but right. I just took a risk. I don't know if you are going short trip or you know the gas is expensive and sometimes uh, you just need to keep the customer. Mm -hmm. And stuff. I I I rarely come all the way out here to Grove City. I rarely come all the way out here, but yeah, it's, nice here, yeah. it's nice, yeah. But you know, she had that discount on the room, so that's why I came out here. Call me cheap, you know. Call me cheap, but. You know, I love a discount. Oh, look at that. That's beautiful, the sun rising, that's beautiful. Yeah, it's supposed to rain though. And then we're supposed to get rain all next week. You know, April showers. Because you know, it's, it's another month. Oh, I, I really, I just need a room. I don't need an apartment. A room is just good enough for me. Oh, you mean the Y? Yeah. You know, I put I put my stuff in my storage unit. You know. Just keep pushing them to get to the yeah. uh, a room's good enough for me. They're already warming up on the ball field. Wow. That's determination. They're out there with the sun. They're, they're out there warming up when the sun's coming up. That's determination. Sort of playing in the rain last week. In the rain, wow. They must have been winning. They must have been winning. That's why they didn't call it for rain. If they were losing, they would have. They would have been like rain delay. Yeah. We'll be crazy. Every every spot is messed up here downtown. I've known it to rain in the bottoms, and then by the time I get downtown, it's it's a sunny, beautiful day. Yeah, it's like a storm. It hits some place. Yeah, some place yeah. Sometimes. 
we got the rain here. Like water. Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, sometimes. sometimes it's thundering and lightning on the east side, and then over on the hilltop, it's a beautiful sunny day. Or not, there's not more traffic. Well, we're the monster trucks are in town this weekend. There's going to be two monster truck shows this weekend, so you'll probably get a lot of business because of that. She got mad at me because I wanted to keep the room key. She said they charge her $5 if I kept the room key. I don't know if that's true or not, but for whatever reason, she didn't want me to keep the room key. I collect them. You know, every time I stay in a motel, I keep the key. I collect them. And she was like, she was adamant. She was like, you're not keeping that key. There's not an exit to 5th. You see, you need to take 5th from the airport. Okay. But if you are coming from downtown, mm -hmm. you have to go all the way to 11 and that And around. then backtrack. You see, instead of <laughs> just exit here on 5th. Is it? Yeah, because that's, that's North Linden right over there. Yeah. yeah that's I see. Well, there's... There's got to be a reason for that. They got to have their reason. Yeah, well, if you are coming from airport, right? But from downtown, you have to travel okay. all the way to 11. And then backtrack. Airport, right? Yeah, backtrack. I'll tell you, this is a little bit of a rough neighborhood. Yeah. Well, you drive, you drive. Imagine walking around this neighborhood, especially at night. It's yeah, a, it's, it's a little it's a little rough. It's, 
it used to be worse. Now it's less. Uh, well, less dungeon than before. Man. Well, it's just, well, you gotta use common sense. You know, it's like, it's like, you know, wait, wait till morning. You don't need to go to like the corner store at like. That, that, you know, your coffee, your pop can wait. You don't need to go to the corner store at, like, you know, the middle of the night. Uh, people, they don't have money, man, and they're addicted to drugs and stuff. That's, yeah. why, that's why they do all kinds of stuff. I, it, dur well, during the summer, I don't know if you noticed this, but oh, yeah. during the summer, no yeah. matter where you go, there's always somebody there asking you for change or money. Especially during the summer, as I like, God, God bless them. Well, because they don't want to work, man. Uh, I think it's more of an addiction thing. They don't want to work. They uh, they just get used to easy money, begging yeah. and stealing. And... But don't you think it's also an addiction thing? They're uh, they're some... they're addicts. Yeah, one. Well, uh, I mean, before you get addict, you, mm -hmm. you need to think about the consequence. If you can't afford, yeah. Uh, I mean. Marijuana, it's okay. Right. But when you start doing crack and cocaine and stuff, that's too much. Too yeah. much, man. It's that's too much. Expensive to do that kind of stuff. At least marijuana, it's cheap. And it's gonna, yeah. and it's, and it's now legal in America. Yeah. And Medical it marijuana. You, it keeps you calm and yeah. nice and quiet. But crack and heroin and all heroin that. Yeah. And all that kind of shit, man. It's too expensive. It, and it's. A, I can't believe. Well, the thing is, like fentanyl, that's just a death sentence. I can't believe people do that because well, you're taking your life in your own hands sometimes. Yeah, you see. But at least I used to smoke marijuana. And stuff. Okay. I mean, it's okay. Uh, it's not costly. Uh, Twenty dollars you can have. I mean, for a week or mm -hmm. a couple of days, and but I mean that stuff is very expensive. A lot of people they sold their houses, their houses. Yeah. I mean, their business just just to get the stuff man